Okay, here's the first fender I made for the rear. This is uh, a piece of sheet metal and it's 18 inches by 6 inches. And I was trying to figure out a good way to um, to bend this without kinking it or um, doing damage to the metal. I wanted to keep it nice and nice and flat and straight. And I don't know if you guys can see from there, but it came out pretty good. And then I thought about how to do it. All I had to do was grab the, the rear tire of the go-kart and uh, grab the piece of metal and just bend it. And then I just flipped it around to do the curve in the back. And there you go. Freaking easy. This one needs a little bit more bend. There you have it. Both the same. I'm gonna round off these corners here so nobody gets hurt on it. I'll round them off. I'll paint it and then on the edge here I'm gonna put some chrome. Anyway yeah that's how I bend it. On the, in this video I'm only gonna do the the rear fenders because I'm still having a hard time filling up my uh, front tires what I'd like to do with the front fenders is have them um, turn with the wheel and in order for me to make them like that I have to have the wheels pumped up and so Anyway, I'm going to finish this and then we'll go from there. Okay, I went ahead and I welded the brackets for the fenders, the rear fenders here. Yeah, I know, I painted the go-kart and, um, and now I'm screwing the paint up, but no worries. Um, I'm going to grind that down and everything and just patch it up. It'll look just like as if I didn't touch it. And this is how the fender is going to look. It's going to come like this. And I don't know if you guys can see, but that's how it's going to sit. Which I think is going to look awesome. Let me just put my hand up here. So it's going to look something like that. Yeah, I think it'll come out real nice. Anyway, I'm going to continue on it and okay, I'm starting to paint the rear fenders. That's the first coat. That's the second uh, fender there. Uh, it's actually not going to be all red. Um, I'm going to do a border of black around. And I'm hoping that it'll look, it'll come out nice. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that, and then um, I'm gonna put it on the go kart, and then I'll show you how it looks on the go kart. But they're actually coming out nice. I like them so far. So here's how they they're coming out so far. Um, got a little bit, got a little bit of over spray over on the red. That's bound to happen. I'm using spray paint, so I'm I'm gonna go over again once with the red after, and uh, see if I can clear it up. It's gonna be hard because once I go over with the red, I'm gonna get over spray on the black. But black is is harder to um, 
to cover up. So, and that's the other one. Uh, I'm yeah, I'm gonna finish this up, and uh, I'm I want to put them on the go kart to show you guys the final product, how it's gonna look on the go kart. It's actually not gonna look as good without the rear spoiler on here, and I'm not putting the rear spoiler on yet until I start the engine and make sure everything runs good. And, and all that right and these are the brackets for the spoiler right here uh, see I painted it all uh, black and everything it doesn't even look like the um, it looks like I put it on there before I painted the go-kart okay so I added uh, three switches here to the panel uh, one is gonna be for on and off for the engine the other two I haven't decided yet I'm gonna get I actually ordered some, um, Atzar gave me a link to some website here in Canada. And uh, I don't know if he gave it to me for a good reason or he just wanted me to spend money. But I ended up spending money. I bought uh, rear brake lights, I bought headlights, and a whole bunch of other stuff from that website. Um, but these are actually nice. I like these. You turn the, uh, You turn it on any one of them you turn it on but as soon as you close these here it automatically turns the switch off so I like those and here's the finished fenders for the rear isn't that sexy yeah that's sexy I like that so let me see if I can get a picture of both of them yeah I think that looks nice as I mentioned um, I can't do the ones for the front yet because I still haven't got my front tires filled up sealed or anything and as I uh, mentioned and mentioned earlier I want to make the front fenders actually turn as the wheel turns so I need the tires to, to be able to do that So I want to take this time to, this is going to be the end of this video, like I said, on another video I'll do the, um, the front fenders, but uh, I want to take some time to thank my subscribers, um, there's only three that show up, like I have 11 so far, but there's only three that show up on my, um, on, on my list on YouTube and everything, so I want to give a shout out to uh, Atzar. Um, David Johnson and Josh Kylan. I hope I pronounced his name right. K I L E N. Go check out their videos. They're awesome. I know because I checked them out. And I'm going to drink to you guys and I'm going to drink to my rear fenders. Cheers.